Hello to all of you. This is Dr. Dawal Mehta, and today we will understand how to carry out decision entry analysis in Rapid Mind. So, decision entries are non parametric supervised learning method used for classification and, and regression. The goal is to create a model that predicts the value of a target variable by learning a simple decision rules inferred from the data features. Now, let us see how we can do this in Rapid Mind. First of all, I load the data set fruits and vegetables. I'll connect this spline with the result window. I'll play the button. Now, I'm interested that what are the what are the attributes on the basis of which the classification is being done of fruit and vegetable. The attributes which are of my concern are vitamin A, C, calcium, iron, magnesium, calories, potential, protein, fiber, and the names have been given. So the first thing which I'll do is select the attributes. I'll simply drag it and drop it here. Make sure the operator is on. Subset it. Select the attributes. Do the selection of all of them. But I'll not select the name because name is the string variable. So I cannot consider for the algorithm. So I'll drop the name from here. Apply. Now I'll set the rules. Set the rule. I have to specify the target variable. So here, the target variable is classification. Make it sure that you convert it into the label. Now, I'll go in this entry. And I'll drop the decision entry here. I'll run the algorithm. And you can see it has given me the output. The first question which we have to ask is, is vitamin A greater than 104? Yes, if it is there, then it is a vegetable. The classification will be vegetable. If it is less than or equal to 104, next question is, is vitamin C percentage greater than 5.5? Yes. Then the next question is, is it less than 115? It is a fruit. If it is more than 115, it is a vegetable. So this gives me a basically a decision. I can also see the decision rules from here. If I want to change the layout of this, I can go here. Radial, balloon, ISOM, circle. But most of the time, we work on three. Now, activate the decision tree, and these are the parameters. These are the hyperparameters on which the classification is carried out. You can change the criteria for the decision tree. Now I will activate the gain index. I can also change the confidence, minimal gain, minimum lift size, minimum size for split. I'll run the button from here and I'll get a different set of rules for the classification. For more videos on, Rep on Rapid Miner, kindly subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on LinkedIn and Twitter. Kindly see my playlist in which I have uploaded many videos of Rapid Miner. Thank you.